You're watching the Big 12 on ESPN, and we're coming to you from Norman, Oklahoma. This one, safe to say, has some extra juice tonight. The Red River rivalry renewed on the hardwood. It's the 104th chapter in a story that started all the way back in 1910. Tonight, the number 11 Oklahoma Sooners welcome a familiar foe the Texas Longhorns inside the Lloyd Noble Center. Texas's starting lineup, seven different starting lineups for the Longhorns. Aismas and Mitchell, the two who have started every game. Use it. Met at the rim and blocked by DeSue. He should have gone up on one foot there, would have been quicker. Hunter, great shot fake, step back and gave it up to Aismas, who nails the three. He should have gone up on one foot there, would have been quicker. Hunter, great shot fake, step back, and gave it up to Aismas, who nails the three. Job is to close out and make him a driver on the drive, penetration, kick out. I mean, that's too easy. Texas Longhorns looking for a rare road win in Big 12 play. Jalen Moore, tough two for the first bucket of the shooter. Right there, two of the best athletes in this league. Two mid-major guys took it up, and he went right by McCullough. Just, just three and a half on the season. He's got two now. That one goes for Suarez. Uzan working on schedule. Got it. That's that two-headed monster we talked about. Here comes Dylan Mitchell, 23 and orange, bringing it up. Ace miss. Nice. Took the tough way to the cup and got the bucket and the box. By making jumpers. Watch the handoff. Downhill, body control, contact, and a chance at an unorthodox three for him. So used to making him behind the arc. Hunter back on the floor for the horns. Five to shoot. The suit working on Godwin. Turn around Jay, and he shows the touch that he's been showing off this Big 12 season. Watch Dylan DeSue now. Tries to get to the rim, he can't. What does he do? Little fadeaway right here. Showing all the things in his bag. Into Baton Rouge, the Pete Maravich Assembly Center will be rocking. Nice, nice. backdoor cut. Beautiful. DeSue to Ace Miss. Hunter. And Weaver with the left hand. Timeout, Porter Moser. But take a look right here. This is the second time in the first half that he blows right by JB and McCollum to the rim. And Porter Moser not happy. He calls a timeout immediately. This kid, you mentioned it, Rich, on Saturday, everything is forced. A lot of that is, deep, is the defense. Weaver blocked by Moore. Here comes Hughley, the big man, leading the break. Moore! To me, two of the best athletes in this league, maybe the two best, but there's 14 teams now. Give me a chance to think about that. <laughs> Here's another turn. Watch out! Moore again! Back to back! Uh, Hunter, uh, Porter Moser wanted to get more athletic. I would say check that box. Jalen Moore at the line has... Let's see if they play straight up. They tried it again. Kasuda Mitchell broken up. McCollum at 10-0 in fast break points for OU so far. Well, and you see J.B. and McCollum speed and athleticism. Beat him up, but get him out in the open court, and he can do this. Terrific high-flying transfer from Siena. The series step back, in and out. Mitchell, what an athletic play, but it goes right to Oklahoma. Hughley! My goodness! Watch Dothard here with the great steal and a look ahead, and the big fella from Cleveland throwing it down. Taken away by Soros. Here's Owe. His first bucket of the night. Got a bluff, but you better stay. That's better. Cunningham for three. Got it to go. Brock That's Cunningham. Big. We've already seen him get open once or twice. Here's more. Had those two monster dunks. This time shows some panache with yep. the left hand off the glass. There he is, number 99. Five years older than his little bro, Otega. There's Dylan Mitchell with the slam. A game high 11 for number 14 in white, Jalen Moore. 
Hunter wheels around, can't get it to go. Great follow by uh, Dylan Mitchell. I just love watching his development. A. Smith. He's a volume shooter, but he's one of the best. I'll tell you he's, what, but he's picked his spots tonight. Man, Tegner, great prep school coach. And then watch Max. You can't leave him. You cannot give Max A. Smith that much room. Figure out the league and then get better. Here's Hunter trying to get on track. Scoreless in the first half, has his first two tonight. He was so good in the first half against Baylor. Tonight, letting it come to him, we know he could get it right. A. Smith spins oh, yeah. and hits. Oh, yeah. And and one opportunity. This right here. You're not going to give him the three-point line if you're smart. They chase him off. It jump stop, pivot, foul, and one. Soft touch for the young man from Jesuit High School in Dallas, the home of Jordan Speed, among others. Down seven. OU with the ball. The lob to Hughley. Now Hughley on the defensive end, guarding to Sue. And he's a tough cover. He sure is. That's that three levels we talked about. It suffered an injury in the NCAA tournament. We never saw the best of him. Texas got to the Elite Eight. Hughley gives it up. And now he gets a dime to Milo Susan. Hughes on to the hole. Here comes Brock Cunningham. Watch him handle the contact. Ever aggressive, kept his pivot foot. Here's a deep three by Asmus. How? Oh. Keep fun to watch or what, folks? Can he play at that Big 12 level? Yes, he can. Asmus. Nice. Triple handoff. Nice. Got nice. it. Oh, well done by Dylan Mitchell. If Texas gets a bucket, it'll be their largest lead of the night. To Sue, gives it to him. Remember, he sat in a chair all summer when he couldn't move that foot after surgery. But you know what? The chair is doing pretty well. Moore. What a game for him offensively. 15 for Jalen Moore. He was a great player. Yeah. Hit a half court. Rare of a buzzer beater to, to beat Chaka Smart. Yeah. And the Texas long one. That one blocked what a by who else? Kendall Weaver. And that's what they're doing. No, don't Hit do that. By Mitchell. <laughs> How good is he? It's Texas's second Big 12 road game and road win of the season. And it's a 15-point victory, 75-60 over OU.